Barack Obama jokingly accused Prince George of breaching protocol after the two met for the first time at Kensington Palace, quipping that it was a slap in the face. Football fans were left devastated after the England team missed out on the Euro 2020 trophy last Sunday the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge and Prince George included. During the game, though, fans loved seeing the seven-year-old sing the national anthem alongside his parents as well as his moments of excitement from the royal box but one moment truly pulled everyone's attention got royal fans saying the same thing. After England's first goal, cameras panned to George, who looked so smart in a white shirt, navy blazer and neat blue tie. The prince quickly hugged his dad before turning to his mom and giving her a squeeze. Following a few more seconds of celebration which saw the royal tot joyfully laughing with his hands on his stomach, George then composed himself, and swiftly tucked in his shirt. As royal fans swoon over the footage, a 2016 report by the Daily Mirror about Prince George's meeting with former U.S. President Barack Obama has resurfaced. Mr. Obama and his wife, Michelle, spent an evening with the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge and then got to meet George, who at the time was only two years old. Images of the prince meeting the former president and the first lady in his pajamas were broadcast around the world. Mr. Obama described George as adorable, but also jokingly accused him of breaching protocol during his last speech at the White House Correspondents' Dinner. He light-heartedly said the young royal's attire showed people were preparing for him to leave office. He claimed that being greeted by George in his checked pajamas and monogrammed bathrobe was slightly akin to his political opponents no longer answering his phone calls. He said, it's not just Congress. Even some foreign leaders have been looking ahead, anticipating my departure. Last week Prince George showed up to our meeting in his bathrobe. That was a slap in the face, a clear breach of protocol. <laughs>